welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. My name is Jillian and today I am going to be organizing my refrigerator. So I want to go into my refrigerator and just give it a good wipe down. Throw anything out that is expired. If I have any leftovers in there, toss that out because I'm pretty sure if there is any leftovers in there, it's been in there for a few days. And recently I've been going to my refrigerator and I've been knocking everything down because everything is just pretty much crammed in there. So I wanna give it a good wipe down and then organize it. So I thought I would take you guys along with me so I can give you guys some motivation of your own. I am gonna show you guys how it looks before and then I will obviously show you guys the after. So let's jump in to this refrigerator organization. All right, you guys, so this is the before on how my refrigerator is looking. As you guys can see, everything is just pretty much crammed in there and nothing is organized at all. So I want to go in and give it a good wipe down and then get rid of anything that is expired or if I have any leftovers in there that needs to be tossed out, then I will do so. So this is the before on how it is looking.
All right guys, so this doesn't look completely perfect, but it looks much better than before. So this is the after on how my fridge is looking. So over here on the door, I just have like butter and cream cheese. And then over here I have condiments and then I have some more condiments right there. And then over here is just some creamer, apple cider vinegar and beef stock, some beer and wine down there. And then up here on the top, I have like all of the drinks. So my husband's sweet tea, some orange juice for the kids, my cold brew espresso, almond milk. I love my kombucha. So I have some of my kombuchas, some of these drinks. These are really good. I like these mm -hmm. and also the sparkling water that they have. Then I have some protein um, shake. I don't really like this brand. My husband bought me this one. I usually get a different one, but he bought me this one. It's okay. Some Orion school waters and then over here I have some fruit and yogurt so I usually have these for Ryan's school lunches or on the go when I'm with Madison and then these for at home some apples I have some green grapes and then I have some more purple grapes back there over here some more fruit some strawberries that I just washed some blueberries and then Ryan really wanted cherry jello so I picked some that up the other day then down here, I just have some like quick meals um, for during the week. So some Bob Evans mashed potatoes and then some carnitas. And I just bought this rotisserie chicken yesterday. So we'll probably have some more of this for dinner tonight. And then some eggs. We go through eggs so fast. I have to get like two dozen of eggs like once or twice a week. And then in the drawer here, I have all of like the cheeses. So the kids string cheeses and then I have just a bunch of other different types of cheese down here. Some lunch meat and then hot dogs back there. And here we have some veggies. I need to go buy some more veggies. We just have some carrots, some spring mix. We have broccoli and then green pepper. And then down here is some potatoes, which we need more of as well. But yeah, that is everything that I sit in the refrigerator. So it definitely looks much better than before. I need to tackle the freezer next. All right guys, so that is going to end my refrigerator organized slash clean with me. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me while I quickly wiped down my refrigerator and also got it nice and organized. I was able to toss out a lot of things that were expired and also took out any Tupperware that I had leftovers that was just sitting in there for a few days. So it definitely feels so much better now that my refrigerator is organized and everything will not be falling over every time I try to look for one item. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and found it motivating. If you did, please remember to give it a thumbs up. Also hit that subscribe button, subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you join my YouTube family. And as always, thank you so much for watching and supporting me. I appreciate each and every one of you guys and I'll see you guys in my next video.